All right, what's up, guys? Poison here. I'm back with Karina, and we're playing some more Ape Escape. Oh, you get a little RC car. You hate the RC car, don't you? So we're here. Today is Saturday. We're just gonna record because she wants to record. We're gonna go for 15 minutes. Yeah, you don't really need to learn the um, controls I'm, for I'm that thing. I'm trying to remember it in my mind, like, uh, how do I use it? Yeah. So, 13 monkeys, 16. What are we going to talk about today? What do you want to talk about? Let's talk about the brand new thing to our fam family, the brand new addition. It's the keyboard. Yeah, so we got a Corsair K65 uh, Rapid Fire, which comes yeah. with gray MX switches. A uh, really good keyboard. Uh, do you like it or I no? I love it. Yeah. Funny story about the keyboard is I've always wanted a mechanical keyboard, mainly just because of the noise they make. And I remember telling Karina a long time ago, I'm like, oh, I'm going to buy one of these keyboards. It makes a bunch of noise. Oh. And she's like, no, I don't want it. I'm not going to like it. I'm not going to use it. As soon as we get it. Yeah. As soon as we got the keyboard, she fell in love with it. And it's a nice keyboard. It has a nice aluminum frame. It's a nice feel. It's not plastic like our old one. Yeah. It's a it's little actually... bit more sensitive, which I kind of like. Yeah. So, you know, it is running Cherry MX switches, which are... Um, they need less um, press down <coughs> to activate it, which means that you don't have to press down as much on a key to actually have the key activated, which is good for gaming, but if you ever have to type on this keyboard, it's horrible. Um, I find when I'm updating our video information to upload a video onto YouTube, I find that I oftentimes actually double click and it messes up. You need to use the uh, helicopter and it's I'm the other saying. one. It's the far left. You're not going to go get some monkeys in the girls one? Why not? There's two monkeys in there. I can't. Even yes, if I can. hit the switch. Even if I hit the switch. They what switch? Still... Go There's back. You There's could jump switch. over. You know that, right? Let's see, let's, let's prove it. Look, there should be an open... There should be an opening. Is there not? So close. Yeah, that's why you had to use the little paramotor thing. Yes, and I don't have it. Oh, you don't have it yet? No! I thought you did. Oh, my. I really thought you had the motor thing. Uh... I don't know what you have. I'm not playing. I don't pay attention to the video. <clears throat> but, um. Let's see. We were talking about the keyboard. We were talking about. Yeah. Um, typing, it's the worst for the keyboard. It's not really good if you need to write any information or anything. Like, write an essay. It's going to be horrible. You're going to have to press backspace a lot to, like, fix your mistakes. Um. Which I kind of want to do a let's play based off the keyboard alone. Um, typing of the dead. Yeah, I want to play the typing of the dead. Uh, if no one knows what typing of the dead is, it's a game. If you guys have ever heard, it's played basically them. a spin-off game of another game about killing what, zombies. What's the House of the Dead? Yeah, it's based off the game House of the Dead, um, which is a Japanese shoot 'em up, mainly in arcades. It has like the arcade um, guns, but um, yeah, in the original game, you just had to kill what? zombies by aiming at them. In Typing of the Dead, you have to type out words to kill the zombie. So it'll give you a sentence, and you type out the sentence, and it'll kill the zombie. Or I think it was a word. Yeah. Well, no. There are words, but then, like, bosses, you have to type out full sentences. Um, even some zombies, you have to type out full sentences. And I've wanted to buy the game for a long time. I wanted to play it, but now with the new <laughs> keyboard, I definitely want to try it. I feel it would be horrible, though. Just so many mistakes and so many lives lost. Um, other than that, I also want to buy some extra keycaps for it, because I just think that'd be fun to have. Yeah. yeah you might want to kill everything first. Hey, look, a cookie. Ooh, ooh, a cookie. Wow. Good job, Karina. Imagine if this game didn't have auto lock on. You know how you got next to the switch and it locked onto the switch? Imagine if it didn't have lock on. How bad would that be? Do you think you would ever hit anything or no? I'm surprised I actually remember how to use this terrible thing. You know, in reality, it's not hard to control it. Or, you expect it to not be hard to control it, but in reality, it's like one of the difficult things to control, huh? How about let's play a game with better bow controls? Let's play Super Mario Sunshine. I've seen some gameplay of it. I'm over here looking at it like, okay, that wouldn't be too hard. It's, it's irritating. Well, I didn't get too far in it because we don't have an actual memory card. We have a memory card. We don't have a working controller. Last time I played, we didn't have a memory card. Yeah, we did. It's 
somewhere lost in that area. Actually, I think I know where it is if I were to look for it. But yeah, we have a memory card. We just need to get an actual like controller that works. Um, I saw GameStop had one last time I went to GameStop, and I didn't think about buying it. I'm like, eh. Well, not an actual controller. It's a knockoff controller, but... Me right round, baby, right round. Yeah, um, GameStop nope. sells controllers. So does Dimple, but it's just... <laughs> right ah! now, money isn't the best to be spending on controllers. Um, so, games. Let's talk about a game no! that's... You could have jumped straight into the boat from no, getting... I was trying to! No, I mean, if you hit the lava, you could have still jumped into the boat. I was gonna risk it. What do you mean, risk it? You would have had to just press a little still, bit to the right. I was gonna risk it. Oh, no. Okay. So let's talk about games that are coming to good <laughs> systems. Ape Escape 3 has been announced on... Or not really announced, no. announced. But there is a it chart... It said there was. Yeah, that Ape Escape 3 should be coming to PlayStation 4. Uh, How do you feel about that? I feel amazing. I honestly want to... <laughs> I'm gonna look away. I don't want to see this. Hopefully you could like Yay, rush this. Yeah, it's working. Hopefully you could rush this because I don't want to sit here agonizing <laughs> looking at this. Honestly, if Ape Escape Three comes to PlayStation Four, I will be hundred percent on there. They better fix the controls for this. It, they're not gonna. They're just gonna enhance the graphics, make it look better. Everything else is still gonna control the same. Everything no. is still gonna be the same, pretty much. It's just I'm gonna look a lot better. It. Um. Room. Speaking of PS4 and VR, do you want to talk about a game you are happy for VR? Neko Atsume. So what is Neko Atsume, first off? Basically it, the one... No, on. I know what it is. I want you to describe it for people who don't I'm, know. I'm trying to catch this monkey right now. No! Gensan? Um, it's basically based off the app. Don't go for it. I, I'm not. Okay. It's basically based off the app where you have to get cats. Mm-hmm. And that, that's all it really is. Just cats. That's it? You just collect cats? Yeah. What are a few of the cats that you could collect? Tubs. Um, should we, like, look for an image of tubs and put it in the video right there? Yes. Alright. And do you know anything about the VR? Like, does it... Is there anything you're supposed to do? Or is it pretty much just the same? Like, I don't what, know. Is there even gameplay of it in VR? Or? Oh, the green ones always irritate me because of the missiles. I don't know anything about the game, and I especially don't know anything about uh, VR. One. Go for it. Just go up there. Oh. It's the exit. Why are you going to go through agonizing boat again? Um, Another PlayStation VR game I'm kind of happy for. <gasps> it, oh, it's not a full-on game. There is a VR mode for the game, though, and I already own it. It is Senran Kagura Peach Beach Splash has a VR-supported mode. Unfortunately, you can't play the game in VR. Um, this is where the game gets weird. You can only use VR when you're looking at the girls. I mean, I'm down for that. <laughs> um, one problem, though, is obviously you would expect, like, oh, what if you try getting an upskirt shot? Thankfully, if you get too close to a girl, it actually censors out the whole screen and tells you to back up. So you can't do anything, like, perverted. You can only just... I Even guess the are. game itself is already perverted enough. Well, true. But I mean, like, you can't, like, go upskirt or anything like that. This whole screen goes black, and it puts a message on it saying, you know, it's a backup or whatever. It worked. Oh, I thought he was going to outrun you. I'm like, come on, Karina. Don't let this happen. One more, I think. Yeah, that's going to be the last I'm one. I'm going to get the cookie instead. Because I'm not going to buy it. And I don't want to. I'm gonna laugh if this guy goes away because he hit that pole. I ain't dealing with this. Why didn't you just go fancy now? You would have gotten the first try. Rip. Yeah, rip to you. You better not be swimming off. I think he swam off already. Did he go the other way? I think he went the other way. Oh, no, he's right there. Okay. Boom. So, we're already at about 10 minutes. You want to go for another match, or you want to just save it for another video? Let's save it for another. Alright, so we're pretty much done with this video. We will see you guys next week with whatever the hell we're going to talk about. We have no idea. Pretty much, we only had enough idea to talk about this one video about the keyboard and VR games and... That's about it. Yeah. So, until next time, have an awesome day. Thank you guys so much for watching. What are you going to get? Oh. Oh. I no, it was I, nothing. I actually. thought she was giving something. Don't stop. What are you doing? We're about to finish. So, until next time, bye.